Well, good morning. It is Tuesday and we are in for much cooler temperatures, not only today, but pretty much the rest of the week. The highs that we saw in the 50s yesterday are gone. Highs in the 40s today, dipping into the 30s by Thursday. Live we'll look on the south side of Lansing. Just a few clouds out there this morning, but we are dry starting off on the chilly side, though, with many of us down in the 30s. It's currently 34 degrees right now this morning in Lansing, 35. The temperature in Jackson, it is 37 outside in Mason. Now highs yesterday, it was actually quite nice. We reached at least into about the mid 50s here in Lansing and Jackson, even a few locations like Owasso in the upper 50s. Today, a much different story. It is going to be a lot cooler with temperatures down in the lower 40s for overall highs across the region. And with a little bit of a wind chill, we'll likely feel more like we're in the upper 30s for a good portion of the day. Now, satellite and radar, we are dry for the time being, even waking up to some sunshine, at least in a few locations. We care out the chance maybe one or two isolated snowflakes or a little bit of some drizzle popping up early this morning. For the most part, though, again, that chance is very small. Most of us will stay dry. We do have a cold front kind of moving through later today and that will bring with it again that slight chance for a little bit of a mix this morning and then we should dry out in the afternoon. So your hour by hour forecast aside from that slim chance for a little bit of some mix we are going to be dry for a good portion of the day. We should see some sunshine later this afternoon and into this year and into this evening. That will give way to some clearing later tonight. That clearing doesn't last all that long. As we wake up on Wednesday morning, the clouds quickly build back in. That will be followed by the chance for some snow at least later in the morning on Wednesday, probably close to around 8 or 9 o'clock. So we'll start to see that snow work its way closer to Lansing and Jackson. From there, as we go into Wednesday afternoon, temperatures should climb above freezing to around 40 degrees, and that will help us change that snow over to a little bit of some mix or more rain anywhere from Lansing to the south. I think if you're along I-96 and points to the north, it will take a little bit longer for that changeover to happen for you. From there, we'll see just a few scattered showers Wednesday evening before we dry out Wednesday night and Thursday. Most of the day will be dry. Can't roll the chance maybe one or two isolated lake effect snow flurries by Thursday afternoon. For today, expect a high of 42 degrees. That small chance for a mix this morning. Most of us stay dry partly cloudy skies and tonight we fall down to around 26 degrees. It is going to be very cold with partly cloudy skies overnight. Your seven day forecast a high of 40 tomorrow with some snow changing over to a little bit of a mix in rain, partly cloudy, a high of only 30 on Thursday. Same temperature Friday with mostly sunny skies, so at least this weekend, Friday and Saturday, there will be plenty of sunshine. Next chance for a mix rolls in later in the day on Sunday. All right, like we were saying, you know, things are starting to look a little bit bleak when like 42 is the high. Oh, when the, yeah, yeah, and the rest of the week you're like, well, compared to the rest of the week, it looks <laughs> yeah, pretty it nice. Looks great. Yeah, yeah, so like I said, I'm my positive spin is it's just helping us get in the holiday spirit early. Yeah, okay, we like that. So we'll take that. <laughs> All right, thank you, Claire. Mm -hmm. And we do have a quick traffic alert for you this morning. A crash is slowing down traffic on eastbound I 496 at Waverly Road, exit three. 